CC or TTV. I had a listing of these things. It was all mine. What's left? Oh. Uh, there was some loser named Matthew Stevens. I looked them up. They're some idiot from Michigan. They sell stuff at a flea market. And they're like, um, patting themselves on the back, saying it's the best thing in the world. Uh, excuse me, I'm congested a little bit. For selling uh, like garbage at a flea market. I wouldn't say that's a great thing. I probably do more selling garbage at a condo land. <laughs> Sorry to be a negative Nancy, but absolutely no one will pay anything for your TV. Most likely you have to pay someone to remove it, and I have no interest. This is back in February, okay. I knew it was going to take a while. I said, you know what, I'll get rid of them though within six months. Uh, it's uh, May now. And guess what? I have someone who wants to buy it. Someone wants to buy the Zenith, and I have someone who wants to buy the Trinitron for 100. Zenith 60. And I had two other TVs that I sold for 50. And I had another TV I think I sold for 50 to this other kid at JVC. Wasn't that the... Man, that's the one I sold... That's the one I sold the other day, 100 bucks. I had the same thing. hundred bucks. I should have asked more for mine but it was kind of beat up and I got wet I think once. Fifty bucks and then I got Rona afterwards. I think the kid had Rona. Yeah. Oh well. I probably could have got more for that one. But I'll find some more. Uh, yeah people are negative Nancy's though. They, they say that you can't get anything and they're idiots. And uh, yeah. I sold a lot of TVs in the last year. I had so many TVs, sometimes I had no room to walk, and it was really annoying. But yeah, they gotta go. They gotta go, man. They're too heavy, and they're just, this one's been sitting outside, and this one's been sitting inside. Alright, useless boxes. Have things that are useful in life. Not useless. Somebody wants this CRT TV. It's so heavy. Who would pay money for this? More on that in a second. Moving your trash found TV, it's helpful to have a trash found dolly. And a trash found piece of wood. Oh, don't do that. Then you damage your CRT TV. The remote too. Well, if it's picture in a picture, I don't think 27s are picture in a picture. I don't think so. Dog's trying to escape again. Doesn't like it here. Oh. Well, I can't even make the turn because there's more crap. You gotta put the TV right over here. But of course, they put more crap. Yeah, she go right over here. But this is the reason, this is a 27 inch Sony uh, Trinitron. I had it for months. Someone I'm related to told them, oh, get rid of that thing. Sell it for like uh, 10 bucks. So 10 bucks. <laughs> you guys give me 100 for it. Oh, messed up over there. Got a trip over there now? No, this dirt. It's just fine. This fine. 100 bucks. That's fine. There's like crap on it now, but that's just the reflection and the debris. Nobody will be able to see it. Maybe there's bugs in there. I don't know if there is or there isn't. But, um,. Someone someone said, oh, give it away for 10 bucks, let's get it out of here, no way. So, sold one for like 50 at JVC, kind of gave that one away. Sold a Zenith for 60, selling this one for 100. Sold two other smaller TVs for 50. You do the math. Oh, people want us give it away. Let's give it away. Anyway, like what crazy man was saying when he was getting a fit. Oh man, you gotta get rid of that thing. Ten bucks, ten bucks. I said, no fucking way. I had to lift that shit. I want at least fifty. I was playing with the price, fifty, sixty, eighty, and now it was a hundred. So my last one. It's only Trinitron. Pretty nice. Support. People buy these things for. Um, what was I gonna say? Usually they're on probably drugs. Seriously, they're probably drug users. And drug users in life, you get a really good deal on things. They don't ask me how I know. And you also sell things for a really high price to someone who's on drugs. Um, so, they're probably on drugs because they buy these things to play old console games. 
If you know anything about computers or anything, you can play old console games on a PC. And the, your modern PC runs them f fairly well. And the performance is nice. You can plug that same old controller in to a USB port with a hub. I use Nintendo controllers. I use PlayStation controllers. I use old, like, uh, some like Nintendo controllers too, like newer ones that have the USB. Some like the Mini. I use those. And there's no issues at all. And people would rather spend money on a TV. Yeah. But I don't care because everyone's on drugs and these people really sound like they're on drugs coming. They sound like they were freaking high on something. And you got to take advantage of these people as a, uh, as a consumer or seller or flipper or just overall hoarder. Um, oh, it's on the cuff of creature cladding because you can profit big time from these people. Um, it's a, I really got to get rid of everything because I have too much stuff. This place is so small. Check out that cooler somebody threw away. You know why they threw it away? Because I was trying to find a spot for it in this garage. There's no room in these places. And there's no room at all. So that's why people throw, also throw stuff away in here. These places are so tiny. You just have to your advantage. Because um, you'll find a pretty good deal on shit. That um, shit that uh, pretty cool deal. That is shit. On uh on things. If I even made sense, I was doing other things. I totally forgot what I was just saying. Yeah, Sony Trinitron 27. Should I make a video of it separate? I don't know. That's a Trinitron 2004, made in Mexico. In the last CRTs. I had a, a 32 or something. I don't know. It was gigantic and heavy. XPR. Yeah. And then they say some kid was here, he was checking the alignment or something of this KVC one I had, calling it an eye chart. And then after that he says his friend had COVID and then I got COVID after that and I don't know. I probably won't do a video of this. Sony Trinitron TV, there we go, we're doing it right now folks. With the little thing on the bottom, well it goes that way. Yeah. Straight out of condo land, folks, because they were installing the blue stream and they had the HDMI and then the blue stream guy told the people they need a newer TV when they like needed a converter box, but people are stupid. So they went out, they bought themselves a new TV, and I got the old one. Could have had like three more of these things too, but I have no other ones. Good park you B bodies just right and you can fit a 27 inch TV in between them without doing any damage. Oh look at that damage. And I own the market because look, CRT TV, all mine used to pop up. And then people are so dumb in other areas of Florida. That's the same one I sold. 100 bucks. JVC, not sold yet. But uh, people are so dumb in Florida, they see my ad. They'll come up over here, more areas nearby, and they think I'm local. I'm getting people from Miami and stuff. to just not very bright but even with the uh even with the other areas you see your tvs just kind of sit here but mine been going hasn't been a tv yet that i haven't been able to sell and we had that guy had to make a video of i don't know if i edited it or not said i will never sell these tvs nobody would even want this tv you were going to have to pay for someone to remove it oh yeah I'm gonna have to pay for something to move it, man. Look at all this fucking cash I got over here from all these goddamn fucking TVs. Oh, yeah. Can't fake stupid. Oh, well. There's that. Look, it has like a serial killer picture, too. It's awesome the way I did it, because I had no room. Look at that one more time. This beautiful picture. Beautiful. Uh, that was the guy right there. He sells at the local flea market. Yeah. Man. Yeah. All right. Yeah, okay. Okay, yeah, right. Sold it last week. That was in February. Oh, yeah, it did take a couple of while, so, but I don't give a shit. 